I'm a dad, and here are my thoughts on our purpose in life. You're free to go, buddy. You can do whatever you want now. You want to climb this? What do you believe your purpose is in life? I'm going to assume right now that if you're young, you might think that you should be famous, like on TikTok or YouTube, Instagram. Maybe you should be making a lot of money. Maybe you should be retiring your parents. Maybe you should be living a luxurious life that you wish you could always have. Maybe you believe you should have a bunch of power and be in control of people. No matter what, you most likely have a belief on what your purpose in life is right now. But where did that purpose come from? I'll tell you where mine came from. When I was in middle school, I thought my purpose in life was to be a YouTube star. When I was in high school, I thought my purpose was to be an artist, to change the world. When I was in college, I thought my purpose was to be an athlete, to be as jacked as possible, to win as many competitions as possible. When I graduated college, I thought my purpose was to make as much money as possible, to build as many businesses as possible, to make as much change in the world, and to be a leader. And then when I became a dad, I realized what my true purpose is in life. You see, when I became a dad, I started to make my own decisions. Before that, I was being influenced by what you're watching right now. YouTube. I was being influenced by social media in general. And as a young male, back in the day, all I was influenced by were other jacked males that were running really big businesses, saying you need to make millions of dollars, saying you need to drive Lambos, saying you need to go and travel to Dubai, saying you need to do all of these things because money's the most important thing in life. Money is going to make it so you can do whatever you want. And that's not wrong. You can do whatever you want when you have money. But you can also do that when you don't have money. See, I was being influenced. And that influence gave me a perspective on my own purpose in life that wasn't true. Now that I have a son, I know what my purpose truly is. It's to experience life. It's to learn about life. It's to go and adventure. We all have a different purpose and it's hard to find that purpose. But what I've learned about life and no matter what is going on, no matter how bad life seems, no matter who's telling you what to do, the one thing we can all do is learn more. We can all learn more about what we should be doing, what places we could travel to, how we can grow food, how we can make food, how we can buy a house, how we can live in an apartment and travel even more and not be tied down to a house. No matter what, there's so much we can do in life and everyone has a different purpose. But one of our main purposes as a human being is to just learn more. Honestly, I'm thankful I became a dad because I was being influenced by the internet, social media. And this has been going on forever for everybody in general. Like we've had magazines, we've had newspapers, we've had the squire on the street that tells the news to everybody when it was in the medieval ages. No matter what, we're always being influenced. And our purpose in life is personal to each one of us. And for me, after being a dad, I realized that what I truly want to do in life is to learn more. I want to adventure. I want to see more of life. I want to see more of the world. And the hardest part about that is that there's social media, which is very addicting, and honestly, I'm addicted to it. Sometimes I fall into a hole and all I can see is the bad things in the world. And sometimes all I can see is people telling me to make a bunch of money. Sometimes all I can see is people telling me to build my own farm. And the hardest part about it is I know what my purpose is. It's to learn. And the reason why I've chosen that as my purpose is because no matter what, when I chose to go down one path, I wasn't happy. I realized that I wasn't feeling fulfilled. I felt like I was being held back. I felt like I didn't have enough passion behind it. And honestly, I used to think I should make a million dollars in a year. I still would love to have a million dollars, but I don't think I need to make a million dollars from running a business. I should just accumulate it over time. Finding this new purpose in life of wanting to learn about life and experience life and see the world has really brought some clarity inside of me. And I feel happier than I've ever felt before. The biggest lesson I've learned from being a father and that has shown me what my purpose is in life truly is that when we're born, we know nothing. We're literally a sack of meat that doesn't know how to roll, that doesn't know how to eat, that doesn't know how to do anything but be fed, comforted, and sleep. That's all we know how to do when we're born. And we get taught what to do throughout life. And as a dad, I realized that, wow, from the beginning of birth, we are learning. We are constantly adapting and figuring out how to navigate this thing we call life. So our main purpose at the beginning is truly that. And the reason why I feel so enlightened that I've gone back on to this journey now of wanting to be a student of life, to be a philosopher and learn more about life and experience it, it's because I'm going back to my roots. And I've only been able to see that because I'm a dad. I don't know if other dads feel this, but this is my take. 
I mean, honestly, I have taught my son how to roll. I've taught him how to crawl. I'm starting to teach him how to walk right now. There are other parents that don't do that. They are more focused on other things in life. Luckily, I am blessed to be a stay-at-home dad and work part-time with all my clients. But no matter what, uh uh-oh, my son is awake. Um, I'm going to stop recording because I'm going to feed him a little bit and we'll get back to it maybe later today on his next nap or maybe when he's just in the video. But he's about to crawl off the bed. Oh, did daddy build you a throne? You see, becoming a dad really showed me that the most important things in life is experiencing things, is having fun with my son and doing things with him. Right, Mr. Man? Right. And honestly, it made it so I broke away from the illusion that we're shown online all the time. The illusion that there's a certain life you need to live. This video's purpose isn't to tell you how to live your life. It's to tell you that I found my purpose in life by deciding what I wanted to do, by choosing what I wanted to learn, instead of letting people online influence me to make as much money as possible, to be as rich as possible, to be as powerful as possible, to be as jacked as possible, to be as healthy as possible. No matter what, they have a purpose and they're just projecting what their purpose is to you and you get to decide if you wanna do it. That's what I learned, right Luca? You can do whatever you want in life. I'm not gonna tell you what to do, but I'm gonna teach you everything you can do. That's what it's all about. We're all just learning. And that's what I found is the purpose of life. And no matter what, right buddy? If you wanna be a king, if you wanna be super rich, if you wanna be the best barber in the world, if you wanna be the smartest scientist in the world, if if you want to be the most fashionista person in the world, no matter what you wanna do, you could do it. Just make sure it's something you've chosen that is your purpose in life. Make sure it's something you want to do. Make sure that you're not being influenced. So seriously, ask yourself, what is your purpose in life? And what do you love to do? I think that's where we're going to end it, Luca. Honestly, I had so much more I wanted to say in this video, but I don't give a shit. Me and you are going to go play. We're going to have a baba and we're going to go on a walk, my boy. Deuces. Actually, I'm gonna go to the gym, so you gotta go to daycare first, and then we're gonna go on a walk. Big kisses! You got so many boogies in your nose, bro. Body slam! Boom! (laughs) If this video has made you think differently in even 1%, leave it a like and hit subscribe so you can change your life with me and Marco.